Hey, everybody. I am Lindsay Zielinski, and I am a part of Looker's product team. And I am here today to talk to you about building tailored data experiences on Looker's platform. Ariel just shared all of the incredible new features that we're building into Looker's core product. But as many of you know, sometimes what you actually need is to bring data outside of Looker. Or maybe you need to build a really tailored solution for a specific use case. We've been doing a ton of research and talking to analysts and developers. And today, I'm excited to announce a rich new set of tools for building these tailored data experiences. Let's start with Looker's embed product offering. 35% of Looker's customers embed Looker content today to help users make better decisions by surfacing relevant insights right into their workflows. Many of our customers are embedding Looker into external contexts, like into their company's website, or into a customer portal. And other customers are embedding Looker content internally, like into their team Salesforce account. But what we've heard from you is that it's really, really important that this embedded content blend in seamlessly with the page around it. And we want to help you build even more tailored embed experiences without necessarily needing to go hire a software developer or learning to become one yourself. So now, as you're building out your embedded content, we're giving you more control than ever. You can customize the look of your tiles, and you can entirely theme your embedded dashboards. And as a part of Looker 7, you can choose from a library of pre-built custom tiles to add to your dashboards, like a social media feed so you can track what people are saying about your company, or a live stock ticker so you can track your company's share price. And with a little bit of development effort, you can now use our embed SDK to build on-the-fly controls for embedded content. So you can give users the ability to configure their dashboards, like you can see here, where we've built controls for users to change their dashboard layouts. Now let's move all the way to the other end of the spectrum and talk about our customers who want to build fully tailored experiences from the ground up to automate workflows and to take action on their data. So historically, um, our customers have used Looker's APIs to do just that. Like, for example, this application that tracks revenue and inventory, or this application that our partner Yeti built that tracks the states with the highest rates of bad loans. But the feedback that we've heard from you is that our APIs do require quite a bit of developer sophistication to use. And so I am excited to announce a suite of new SDKs that make, yeah, 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 clap, that's good, that's good. <laughs> These SDKs make our APIs more accessible to developers to work in the languages that they're most comfortable with. And we're taking this even one step further. We are packaging up common UI components so that developers can more quickly assemble fully tailored applications. These components are things like visualizations, filters, and navigation. All of these tools are meant to unlock the creativity and the imagination of our users to build whatever your teams need. But we didn't want users building outside of Looker to have all the fun. 
And we're now making it possible for users to build these experiences right inside Looker. Developers will soon be able to build internal tools, like this data dictionary, that allows users to search for and explore their data. It'll also allow you to visualize your relationships between data sets and explorers so that you can understand which data sets are used the most and which explorers are duplicative. And yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> we are also, uh, also on this developer framework, you can build things like this cohort analysis tool which allows you to visualize trends over time by customer and user group. Both the data dictionary and the cohort analysis tool are launching with Looker 7. And these are examples of what you can now build really, really quickly using this new development framework. Now that we've built this incredibly powerful framework and this new set of developer tools, we needed a way for developers to share all of the incredible things that they're building with the rest of Looker's users. And with that, I am thrilled to announce Looker's new marketplace. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The marketplace uh, will allow developers to deploy all of the incredible things that they're building for the rest of Looker's users to discover and install. And installing through the marketplace is really, really fast and easy. In under a minute, you can install a pre-baked model and a dashboard, like this example showing Snowflake usage, or maybe a goofy cartoon graph, or an even more advanced visualization like this calendar heat map. And even full, robust applications like Looker's sales analytics application can be installed and configured in just a couple minutes through the marketplace. We are launching quite a bit of content with the marketplace, but stay tuned for this volume of content to continue to expand throughout 2020. Looker's partners are really eager to add their solutions to this new marketplace. And I'm happy to share that starting in early Q1, our third-party developers will be able to distribute all of the solutions that they build on the marketplace. <laughs> the feedback on all of the new developer tools that we're launching with Looker 7 has been incredibly positive as you can see by this partner quote uh, by Four Mile. So, as you are building out your roadmaps to build better data experiences for your customers and for your internal stakeholders and your business users, keep in mind that you can now take advantage of all of the incredible new tools that Looker is launching with Looker 7. Dynamic embedded dashboard controls using our embed SDK. SDKs for our core APIs and pre-built UI components so developers can more quickly build fully tailored experiences. A developer framework for building internal tools. And finally, a marketplace for discovering and installing all of the rich creations built by the brilliant developer minds contributing to Looker's platform ecosystem. And with that, I will pass the mic to my teammate Sandra to talk to you about all of the infrastructure powering these rich data experiences. <laughs> 